Good day everyone, this is Jake Rodriguez Pomperada from Bacolod City, Negros, Occidental, Philippines. In this tutorial video, we will learn how to write a very simple payroll program using C programming language. This payroll program will ask the user the employee's name, the number of days work, and then the daily rate of the employees, and then it will display the name of the employee and then the salary of the employee. Before we start, if you like this video tutorial, please hit the like button, leave a comment in the comment section of this payroll, of this uh, video tutorial, and subscribe to my channel for more upcoming video tutorials. So let's get started. <laughs> okay, sorry guys, sometimes I, I make a mistake now when, when talking. So this is very common, especially I'm doing... A straightforward video tutorials there's no editing I am only edit my video if the video most of the time there are so many errors from my end but most of the time if there is a minor mistake from my end I let it go no so, uh, I continue making the video so that you can see that this is very real authentic straightforward programming so here we are here in our dev C++ IDE or integrated development environment so here I will just uh, uh, write down sharp include stdio.h for in our input output sharp include string.h for our string manipulation so int main car imp name let's say for example 200 the size of the characters refers to the name of the uh, employee and then here uh, int days work 0 and then we have here float rate per day equals 0 dot zero zero load for decimal places so here print f print f uh, payroll employees payroll system in C this will be the title of our program print f backslash t give employees name gets name print f backslash t number uh, give number of days work uh, scan f percent d and percent days work print f backslash t enter i give uh, rate per day scan f percent f percent rate per day so here float sold salary assignment statement sold salary equals days work underscore work 
multiply mm, rate per d underscore d Okay. Print F. Let's see, for example, uh, employees name percent S. Name. Let's see, for example, here, salary, hmm, let's see, for example, in dollar sign, 2.2F, yeah, two decimal places F, so here, so, so, salary, print f plus plus t end of the program system pause and then we end now here explain uh, no sorry Okay, we I have done already coding, guys. Let me explain first the things that transpire in our code. No, so here we discuss the library files that is being used, and then variable declarations, and then title of the program. This portion of our program will ask the employee's name, number of days work, in integer, and then rate per day. Now, in this expression, solve salary will act as assignment statement in our program. This work multiplied by rate per day. It will be stored in this particular variable, solve salary. And then here, it will display the name of the employee and then the salary to the similar places. After which, our program will display this message on the screen indicating that the program has already ended. And then the system pause, uh, those command, this operating command, this operating system command to pause the execution of the program. This will be stored used using this library file. I forgot. This the lib dot h. Let us save our work. Control S. Uh, new folder salary in C. Salary dot C. So here, compile and run. What's the problem? Duplicate, close parenthesis. Okay, let's say for example, uh, the name of the employee is Jacob Samuel. Pomperada. He is my son, actually. Number of this work, 10. Rate per day, 150.75. Okay. We have here the salary to decimal places. But the problem is, what's the problem? Formatting. Okay, again, we will run the program. employees payroll system in C give employees name Jacob Samuel Pomperada 15 days salary 235.12 
So employee's name Jacob Samuel Pomperada His salary is 3,526.80 I run again our program Juliana Ray F. Pomperada She is my daughter Number of this work 10 Rate per day is around 341.67 dollars so here we go here we got it right guys so we multiply 341.67 by 10 so we have here 3416.70 so employees payroll system in C give employees name Juliana, Juliana Ray F. Pomperada give number of days work we give it 10 give rate per day 341.67 so it will display employees name Juliana Re F. Comprada employee salary $3,416.70 and of our program here we go guys we have already done writing our very simple payroll program using C programming language I hope that you learned something new in this episode of our video tutorial making a simple payroll system in C. Before we end, if you like this video tutorial, please hit the like button, leave a comment in the comment section of this video tutorial, and subscribe to my channel for more upcoming video tutorial. This is Jake Rodriguez Pomperada from Bacolod City, Negro Occidental, Philippines. Until to the next video tutorial, bye bye for now.